me tell you why you think flat earth is so ridiculous. It's because of propaganda pictures like this. No flat earther believes this. Not one. That's funny. You're a funny dude. You're a funny little dude. Now let me show you why the globe is so ridiculous. And this is all you guys have. This is the proofs of the globe. You got NASA images, public indoctrination, and popular opinion. Oh, hey, that is bullshit. I think that's one of the main things is the popular opinion because, oh, you're a flat earther? Are you some sort of retard? Yes, actually. Yeah, okay. Yes. Right, yeah, yeah. Our only problem is that we haven't been properly indoctrinated like you have. Now, why is it such a sin to ask a question? That just raises further questions. So just by our eyes, we see that the sun and the moon are the exact same size, but you've been indoctrinated to believe that the sun is 400 times further and 400 times bigger, but they just appear to be the same size. They're not the same size, you silly peasant. No shit, Sherlock. And a lot of people want to come and say the absolute ridiculousness of what we're saying, but you literally have never seen this. If this plane is going over the ball earth, how can we never see something like this? He didn't just say that. I mean, this is ridiculous. I agree. But your beliefs are ridiculous. And so that's why we're exposing them. So um, I'm going to just shut my eyes for a bit. Go on. I'm listening to everything you say, okay? Answer me this. Why is it that all the people who control the globe, you know, the globalists, why is it that they all have these flat earth maps? Because you're an idiot. Oh, yeah, that's it. And I did a video on this, but if the deepest hole that was ever dig was just short of eight miles, who came up with this nonsense? Who came up with this meme? Tell me I did not just see that. Trust me, I know it's hard to break your cognitive dissonance, but this is what you think the Hubble telescope is. This is what it is in reality. Don't talk out loud. You lower the IQ of the whole street. Again, what you think they're doing on the ISS, what's really going on? Look up bubbles in space. Look up the guy that almost drowned in space. What do you say we cut the chit chat a hole? So you think that gravity makes you stick to spinning things, right? Okay. Let's have a little science project. These are my children. This is me spinning them. Cool. <laughs> cool. And for some reason, they're not sticking to this thing. But instead, they're about to fly off. Come on, let's keep a little optimism. Look at them, just holding on for dear life. Why are they not sticking to this merry-go-round when it spins? This gravity is really weak, guys. This is a joke, right? Right? Wraith? Look at this. Still holding on, about to fly off. Oh, there goes another one. We're debunking gravity. Ha <laughs> that, ha! That's genius! <laughs> yeah, you're, you're a wizard. You're a mastermind.